Welcome to NBA Basketball. This is 2K Sports bringing it to you live. The NBA playoffs tip off with round... The playoff battle in the West starts off with a bang right here. Game one. Hi, everyone. Kevin Harlan with Steve Kerr and Clark Kellogg. The NBA playoffs are officially underway. Now, State Farm presents our starting lineups. First for the Hornets, Chris Paul and Bellinelli in the backcourt. And the man patrolling the middle, Ameka Okafor. He's a big part of that presence down low. Then it's Trevor Ariza. And it's West in at the four shot. And then... For the Los Angeles Lakers, Fisher and Kobe man in the backcourt. And they've got Andrew Bynum, the big man, all in the middle. They look to him to provide that necessary presence down low. Then there's our test, and it's Gasol and at the power forward. Because they're the second seed, they'll have home court advantage through their next two rounds. Well, that was not an easy play, but he made it look routine. Goes right up. Can't get it to go. Paul with the defensive effort. Gasol with the steal. Free throw line jump shot. Walker four with the rebound. Hey, he's worked hard to improve his jumper, but it still hasn't clicked for him. Here's West. Good, and Paul gets the assist. West has got the opening basket of the game for the Hornets. Here's Fisher. Let's it go. And the Lakers with another miss. I don't mind that shot, though. He's an excellent three-point shooter. He's just showing a lot of confidence there. I'm right with you there, Steve. I mean, let it flow when you're feeling it. And stolen by Fisher. Fast break. Here they come. We'll go to Doris Burke, who spoke with head coach Monty Williams. He talked about how important this game is to them because it sets the tone for the rest of the series, saying to win or lose, what is important in this opening game is that we play tough, we play smart, and we let them know they're in for a heck of a fight with us. Guys? Thank you, Doris. Paul gets to a reason. Back to Paul. Hooker four with a screen on Fisher. And West backs in. Shoots. The Lakers with the rebound. And going against New Orleans, their first game of the NBA's regular season. And Gasol gets it to go. He had a man in the paint. He found him with a nice assist. Now here's Paul. The dish to Bellinelli. Oh, that's blocked. He goes up again. West gets the bucket. West has got his second best.
Welcome to 2K Sports in the NBA. I'm your host, Damon Bruce. The NBA playoffs tip off. A playoff battle in the West. Let's take a look now at the State Farm starting lineups for Game 1. First for the Hornets, Chris Paul and Bellinelli in the backcourt. And the man patrolling the middle, Emeka Okafor. He's a big part of that presence down low. Then it's Trevor Ariza. And it's West in at the power forward. And then for the Los Angeles Lakers, Fisher and Kobe man the backcourt. And they've got Andrew Bynum, the big man, all in the middle. They utilize his abilities to maintain that presence under the rim. Then there's our test, and it's Gasol out at the fourth. Because they're the second seed, they'll have home court advantage through the next two rounds. Fisher is tagged with the reach. That's his first foul. Here's Bellinelli. A three ball. Rebound by Ron Artest. From deep three-point range, the shot is off. The Hornets go the other way with the ball. And, of course, this is the first they're seeing of the Lakers. Here's New Orleans. Paul outside. Back to West. And he feeds it to Paul. Good ball movement. West over Gasol. A rebound by Kobe Bryant. Now they've got to be careful. They can't give him that much room because at that range, he'll make you pay. Let's find out what Doris Burke has for us. Kevin, I was able to speak momentarily with Monty Williams. You can put coach in the crowd that feels game one is the most important game in the series. He said to take the first game on the road would put us in the driver's seat from a mental advantage as well as a home court advantage. Guys? Thanks again, Doris. And Bellinelli kicks to Paul. The fader. A rebound by the Lakers. Well, he turned a high percentage shot into a low percentage shot by trying to go to the fadeaway. Out of bounds. They'll keep possession. Here's Kobe over Bellinelli. And Kobe the bucket with the assist by Artex. Kobe's got the first points up on the board tonight here for the Lakers. Bellinelli with the three. No one. Still looking for that first two. Goal four now. The shot is off. Good D by Ariza. And here are the Hornets now. Paul kicks to Bellinelli. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. Still can't quite get anything to fall after five tries. Again, the miss by Kobe. On defense, the Lakers. Straight up, and it's sent back by Bynum. And it's the Lakers ball. Shoots from 12. Jump shot is good. Kobe's got his second bucket of the night. Guy is a potent offense right now. Yeah, yeah, really the offense is flowing quite nicely right now. Playing with a lot of confidence, just uh, some self-assurance. I, I like what we're seeing. They are setting the tone here early with their work on the boards. Yeah, only a moderate advantage here, slight one, but as the game wears on, it's one they'll definitely look to build on. All against Fisher. Ariza, right side, and the bucket counts. There's on his way to the free throw line, trying to make it a three-point play. And some changes here for the Lakers. Lamar Odom is checked in for Gasol. Brown comes in for Kobe, and Steve Blake is subbed in for Derek Fisher. And the Lakers have possession. It's a three-point game. The shot by Odom, no good. This guy's a good three-point shooter, but that was probably from a little bit too far. Yeah, not what I would call working to get the best shot either. Landry, and a great assist by Paul as that one goes in. The Lakers in the lead, and taken away by Paul. 
Great job playing the passing lanes and forcing that turnover. Here's Green. And so he draws the foul on the shot on a trip to the line to shoot two. Hello and welcome to 2K Sports. I'm Damon Bruce and it's time for a little NBA battle. The playoff battle in the West starts off with a bang right here. Game one. Hi everyone, Kevin Harlan with Steve Kerr and Clark Kellogg. Let's take a look now at the State Farm starting lineups for game one. First for the Hornets, Chris Paul and Bellinelli in the backcourt. And the man patrolling the middle, Emeka Okafor. They utilize his abilities to maintain that presence under the rim. Then it's Trevor Ariza. And it's West in at the foresight. And then for the Los Angeles Lakers, Fisher and Kobe man the backboard. And they've got Andrew Bynum, the big man, all in the middle. They look to him to provide that necessary presence down low. Then there's our test, and it's Gasol and at the four spot. So important in a seven-game series to maintain the home court advantage. The fans, the players, the coaches, guys, they know it's all on the line. Al Paul. Gasol covering. The open shot call. And Andrew Barnum pulls it down. The shot. And it's good. Terrific work on the offensive glass to make that one work. Here's Paul. Earlier, Doris Burke spoke with head coach Mike Brown. And what you find out, Doris? I asked him about what his goals were coming into this game one, and he said, win at all costs. If we can't come out strong here, then everything we've worked for to get home court advantage at this point goes out the window. They don't want to see that, gentlemen. Always great to hear from you, Doris. Here's a reason. Some solid defense from Gasol. Great close out there, forcing the Aaron shot. Well, he made it a tough shot again. He didn't give up on it, and he got a hand on it. And here are the Hornets now. This, of course, their first opportunity to play the Lakers. Gathers. And there's a reason. That's good on the assist by Paul. Ariza's got five. He got a little room at the rim and laid it in. Great play. And again, the Lakers, no good. Here's Paul. Gasol covering. Paul passes to Bellinelli. Fires the three. No what? And it's the Lakers taking it the other way. Coach is liking Clark what he's seeing from his offense. And too, why wouldn't he? I mean, guys, they're filling it up with ease, executing, getting quality shots. I mean, this is fun to watch. Yeah, this is like a clinic out there, guys. This is exactly how you attack a defense. Move the ball, sharp cuts, a really a nice pace to their offense. Ameka Okafor, the bucket on the assist from David West. Here's Fisher. Right around, three minutes left to play here in the first. Kobe, that's for two, and the Lakers with another miss. New Orleans has come out of the gates quickly. From the arc, and that's good. Marco Bellinelli for three. They just lost him on the break that time defensively. I mean, he slid out to the three-point line and had plenty of room. Guys, you just don't realize, maybe Steve does, but you can't, really, you can't imagine how difficult it is to hit a shot that deep. Man, that was, that was as sweet as honey. <laughs> Clark, I think it's pretty easy, actually. <laughs> 
and West backs in. Here's Ariza. West is called for a loose ball foul. That's his first foul. Some changes for the Lakers. Lamar Odom has checked in for Bynum, and Matt Barnes is subbed in for Ron Artest. Carl Landry's checked in for New Orleans. Green comes in for Marco Bellinelli. Lakers trail by five. Here's Kobe. And the Lakers with another miss. I don't mind that shot, though. He's an excellent three-point shooter. He's just showing a lot of confidence there. I'm right with you there, Steve. I mean, let it flow when you're feeling it. Here's Landry. Rest outside. Gasol with the steal. You know, he got a fingertip on it, but not enough to control the pass coming in that fast. The Hornets leading by five. Ariza outside. Paul. Landry a sweet on Fisher. Here's West. Good, and Paul gets the assist. Paul's got three assists tonight. Oh, I like the fluidity I'm seeing from them on offense. It's a thing of beauty. Fun to watch. Yeah, it is. They're moving the ball well, finding the open man, making that extra pass. They're playing very unselfishly right now. So timeout call here. The first for Los Angeles. Well, all these missed shots is a definite concern. I like this timeout. I really do. Settle everybody down and try to refocus them on the game plan and execution. And there's a minute 45 left in the first quarter. Kobe kicks to Fisher over Paul. And that one's good from Fisher. Fisher's got his second basket of the night. Here is Paul. Looking for his first bucket of the game. Now here's Ariza. Guarded now by Lamar Odom. Just five to shoot from downtown. And that one's good. Eight points for Ariza. And a great start offensively. Yeah, they've come out strong. I mean, really scoring and playing with confidence. The shot by Kobe, no good. On offense, here are the Hornets. They're on a 15-5 run heel. Landry, a screen on Fisher. Kobe against Paul. Here's West. And it's New Orleans scoring again. Now, I'll tell you what, they've been a step slow here early on. I agree with you. I mean, they're allowing too many open shots. They seem a little sluggish to me. The shot by Odom, no good. It's clear they had one thing on their mind when they came out of the gate today. Rebound. Yeah, and they've opened up the game with a pretty good margin in that area. Great sign for this club. That's good. Green's got himself going there. His first points of the game on the deep ball. Well, another uncontested three there. They've got to make some kind of an adjustment. I mean... They're giving up way too many open threes. Well, the last five hoops, three have come off wide open three-pointers, Clark. So it's one thing to give up one, but if you start giving three-pointers up in bunches, you're in big trouble. Here is Paul. Still looking to get on the scoreboard. Bynum gets the reach-in call. That is his first foul of the game. Here's Landry. Four seconds left. Paul can't get it to go. I like the shot despite the miss. I mean, that's his range. Double-digit lead on the scoreboard as we end the first quarter of play.